This episode is sponsored by Shutterstock.com. With over 20 million high quality stock photos, illustrations, vectors, and video clips, Shutterstock helps you take your creative projects to the next level. For 30% off, head on over to Shutterstock.com and use offer code GAMEBREAKER7. This episode is also brought to you by Audible. For a free 30-day trial and to receive a free audiobook, just head on over to audible.com slash gamebreaker. Hello, Internet Magic Man here from freetoplay.tv, bringing you another episode of Dat Game, our first look series. Today we're taking a look at Infinite Crisis. Now this is the upcoming free-to-play MOBA game with all the DC Universe characters by the team at Turbine. It's currently in a closed beta, but it's it's not that hard to get an invitation to, so I'll give you a link to the site you can sign up if you want to. Now, you know me and MOBAs. We're going to spend about 15-20 minutes in here checking the game out. But I'm just not freaking good at them, and you guys know that. So I've brought a friend with me, someone I consider to be my kind of go-to guy when it's when it's MOBA time. You know him, you love him from Game Breaker TV, JKK Kennedy. How are you, sir? Doing all right tonight. Now, you've been playing this for a while, huh? Yeah, I play a little bit of Infinite Crisis whenever they open up the weekend beta times and stuff, jump in for some games. Well, what we're going to do is you can kind of school me on not only Infinite Crisis, because I'm sure there's a lot of viewers out there that want to know a bit about the game, but you can kind of give me some MOBA tips while we're going, maybe turn me into a PvP guy. So right now it's asking me to pick my knowledge of the game. Uh, what's a MOBA? I'm Rusty, or I'm a pro. I I'm thinking of going with I'm Rusty. I'm familiar with MOBAs, but I haven't played in a while. I, I think that's the way to go, right? Definitely probably the way to go. I think that's how most people do. <laughs> Pro says you're ready to play a MOBA competitively, and we both know <laughs> that that's just not going to happen. <laughs> Nowhere near that one, are we? <laughs> All right, so let's see here. I got my home. I got the store. What, what do we got in the store here? What's in? Is it just heroes? How are they work in this, Jay? Um, we actually got some um, champions, heroes, heroes, which you ever want to call them in this um, game. Um, available to use actually quite a few here. There's also some co um, costumes for them as well. Now they're doing. So, why do they call them champions? These are like Marvel or DC Universe heroes and villains. What's with champions? Damn um, it. it might just to be. I don't know. Keep it in line with League of Legends people. Oh uh, yeah, you're probably right. I got that whole big game in this genre. Yeah, Poison Ivy. Now they've given me some coins here, so I can. What are what are these coins called? They're yeah, called. They have they're two called, types of coins. Yeah, what's we got gold and silver. What's the difference here? It looks like gold and they could both be used for these different uh, champions. Um, the golden ones are used are like the in-game like money that you buy that you buy from a cash shop. Gotcha. And, and the silver ones or whatever you want to call them are the ones you earn throughout the game. Oh, man, look at that. Zatanna is one of the unlockables. Now, being Magic Man, I would have preferred a male magician, but Zatanna was so cool from the Batman series. And she does have a um, bundle package right now with a costume. Ah, it's like you work for them, Jay. <laughs> You're trying to sell me on it. Oh, she's a support character. Get the hell out of here. No, that's just not going to happen now. Forget that. <laughs> I can't support myself, much less support other people. So let's take a look at my, here's my profile, which I've got nothing going on. Stolen powers. What the hell does that mean? <laughs> Your stolen powers. It's, I've They're got like tabs here. for main, champion, amplifiers, and stolen powers. Stolen powers sounds sweet. All right, let's go back to home here. Now, do I have to friend you? Can, can we make a friends list or something to play? From there is not a friends list right now. We basically just have to invite each other if we want to create a group. It's not a very um, user interface into not very friendly right now. Okay, so I go to play, I click group, create a group by visiting the, or using the instructions below or wait here if I'm expecting an invite. Please enjoy the music. Well, that's <laughs> awesome. Okay, so I've got to do a little slash G invite. And what is your name there? JK Kennedy TV. Imagine that. Branding. 
group invite sent. Oh, okay. It wasn't that hard. Would have been easier with a friends list, but no biggie. Now we're going to look for a group. And uh, so so I'm, I don't want support. I suck. So I, I really don't want to put other people depending on me in a support role. So should I go as like a kind of newbie, not very good at MOBAs? Would you recommend that I play more tanky characters or more DPS characters? School me a little bit, Jay. Um, on this game right now on the map, you probably want to play something with range attacks just to keep your distance and get used to those controls. Oh, we got a match. So this is going to depend on what you have unlocked. I'm not sure what the default unlock ones are. Yeah, we'll take a look at, at what champions I have here. Waiting for that last guy. Cue it up. Cue it up. And got denied. Yeah, that guy left. Or girl left. One of the two. Come on. Nine out of ten. Let's do this. Otherwise, this is going to be the longest first look ever. Oh, come on. <laughs> Eight out of ten. Nine Matt out of ten. Doing so well. Right? <laughs> Nine out of ten. Ten out of ten. There, there we, we go. go. Third time's it. Wow. Okay. It looks like I have quite a few. I got. Uh, I got Flash here. I've got. Is this Nightmare Batman? Oh no. This is uh, Ruthless Abomination, Doomsday, The Joker, Zatanna. Yeah. So Catwoman. something else if you notice is there are different. Uh, like you got different types of Batmans in there. Yeah. Like Nightmare I'm looking at Batman. Nightmare Batman. It's my favorite from the comics, man. Yeah, he's an assassin type character with a stealth with a stealth ability, and then right below him you should see Gaslight Batman, who's a um, he's got some range attacks and stuff, and he's more of a just like a like regular a ra range DPS type damage. dude. Yeah, he's yeah. got a hybrid damage champion, ranged marksman. Yeah. What are these skills he, here? Yeah, you know we're gonna slant. do this. We're gonna do Gaslight Batman. He can actually um, use one of his skills to swing himself across the map a little bit. I made my parents. And there you do go. have, just like in League of Legends, you do have some abilities down there at the bottom. Um, and they it's show up on your side. Detonate and like, surveillance camera. <laughs> yeah, and you can click on one and you can switch them out. Um, oh, you do have the ability gotcha. Super Strength, the one with the picking up the car. You can pick up the cars in the game and throw them. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to switch that there. And then what are my normal skills? I've got Echoes. Uh, basic attack applies Echoes for four seconds. Target with Echoes are revealed. Lose five attack armor. Uh, uh, uh. Okay, and then Sonic Batarang. That sounds that sounds awful. Like that, that would hurt. 55, okay, so that's a ranged attack. Sonic Shell explodes when it reaches range or when it's triggered again. Okay, so yeah, you're right. It's all based on range, pretty much here. I didn't get a chance to look at my last two, so we'll just have to see how it goes. The screen's looking very familiar, like uh, every that, every see, other MOBA ever. <laughs> see the anime-looking character in the game? Uh, yes. That's ac that's actually Catwoman, with a with that's a costume for Catwoman. Is Star Fox Reloaded. Yeah. She's an assassin, so stay away from her. It's pretty dangerous. If you can flash, stay away from him. Just, like, stay away from him. That's about all I can tell you. Oh, nice. That, that bodes well. So I'll be sure to get uh, ripped apart by Flash a couple of times then, now that you've already warned me to stay away. Now, I have taken a look. At, this is, like, my first time into a full match. I haven't played a full game yet. I thought we'd do this first look old school. It was really the first look type thing. But I did see the... The map wasn't it wasn't typical three lane. It was round. What's going on with that? No, it's not your familiar three lane um, defend and destroy map like we see in League of Legends or Dota. But it actually is very reminiscent, and I would almost say the same as the League of Legends Dominion map, the secondary mode they had created um, uh, over a couple years ago, maybe. Mm -hmm. um, doesn't get as much play time in League of Legends, but it seems to be the what they decided to create first and test first here in Infinite Crisis. Um, it allows faster gameplay, so it probably allows them to test out um, uh, faster matches and stuff. Now, the objective's still kind of kind of the same. Get to the other side and, and down the target, right? 
actually know. Okay, well, um, see, now this is useful information. I need this kind of kind of stuff, and since 14 isn't really loading very well here in the uh, in our opposition, <laughs> we have some time to s discuss strategy. Yes, it's actually you have five points on the map, and they go around the outside like an outer circle. There's one point at the top, and you've got two at the bottom, and then there's like two more basically in the center on both sides of the map. Okay. And the objective is it's a it's a um, hold the point. Okay. You you take the point and you hold it. You want to defend it and stuff. Whoever has majority points, more majority holding points, they get the increase in their points. If you have the fewer ones, well, gotcha. you're going to lose your points and you're just going to lose the game. Now it's a, it's, so it's a resource it's a resource based map. We hold as many points as possible to gain points faster to a point limit, right? Yes, and I actually okay. think it's the, it's the other way. I think it's the other way around. You lose points if you don't have them. But. Oh, okay. So it's counting down to zero rather than up to a target. Yes. Okay. Cool. 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 Uh, what's going on here? Our opposition has a player that cannot connect all the way. <laughs> that might be beneficial on our side. Oh, here we go. Nice. Now, first, visually, it doesn't look too bad. I mean, I kind of like the comic book look. The game does have a nice visual approach to it. The UI is not intuitive, though. No. Okay, so right-click is moving my character around. Typical QWER for my abilities at the bottom. DNF for my items. All right, all right. Or not my items, my special powers. So, yeah, pretty familiar, right, to just about every MOBA player. Maybe a little different on the, the cursor. Three points to spend. Oh, yeah, that would probably help. Whoops. <laughs> and they do have a recommended system, so you can click on the recommended and just <laughs> follow their routes if you want to. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, let me just click recommended enough times to max my points out. There we go. All right, so it just gave me some nightmare boots for speed and Atlantis Gambit. So we got typical item type gameplay going on. Certain yes. characters are gonna benefit from certain num uh, for certain items. Now, what's are we? Is this started right? Yeah. Actually, yes, we have. Why are we all just chilling here? <laughs> Let's go up top. All right. Our our team seems to be already lagging behind. Uh, okay. Um. All right, so there's my skill shot. Eh, okay. Indeed. Okay, so I got to hold down spacebar to keep my camera going, huh? All right. The enemy has captured Couldn't figure out how to get my camera to follow my character for a minute. Yes, yeah, spacebar will lock to your character. Okay, you see we have this point captured now? Yes. And he's coming to take his point back from us right now. But we do have some minions here to help us. Oh, yeah. Uh -huh. Alright, so just hold down right mouse and I get my my abilities there. Gotcha, gotcha. Oh, I just got ganked from behind. That's not good. Not good. <laughs> not good. Oh, and that was the assassin type character coming on you. Damn it! Oh, I hate MOBAs. I'm so freaking awful at them. So that's important to note for people that this is a more Dota type thing. It doesn't really exist in League of Legends, but on top of your abilities, you see that little the little icon to the left of your abilities. Yes, I'm, I'm getting ganked. That icon is like a is like a passive stat amplifier for your character, which isn't really around in um, League of Legends. So that's something to take note of. Gotcha. Gotcha. All right, we lost point five, so that's that's not good. So for our first game, we are getting dominated, and we have yeah, we're Flash getting team. Is I'm the, this is this is not going good. I'm gonna die again, son of. <laughs> that's twice, Jay. Twice already. Let's take a look at the scorecard. Oh, it's zero, two, and zero. Off to a fantastic start. <laughs> Let's go to the leaderboards. 
Actually, nobody on our team has a kill yet, so. Well, considering we all started late, and we have one <laughs> yeah. player who's AFK. Yeah, we were like, uh, was, did this match right start? Now. Oh, well, I kind of walked right into that, uh, that ultimate, didn't I? Dear Lord, man. Now, I'm noticing, though, that the controls... While they're familiar, they're a little uh, different to the point that I'm not quite picking them up very quickly. I yes, keep is, I keep finding myself clicking and not doing anything because I've reverted back to like a League of Legends control scheme. If you go to your preferences, hitting escape and go to your preferences, you oh, can't. I'm not change. saying it's going to help, yeah. Justin. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, um, I actually have mine switched. I'm moving with my left click instead of the right click. Right click seems to be the default. Right. And left click is for your attacks by default. Oh, look at this. We got a point. We're going to take a point back, Justin. Yes, and part of the reason we got a point is because they captured something unique in this uh, in Infinite Crisis, a point in the middle. What? That's going to drop a huge like meteor strike in the on the map somewhere. Wow, yeah, this isn't even close. 496 to 121. I mean, we're, we're getting hurt. Something's going on on your computer, man. I'm looking at Wayne's tomb. I just died. <laughs> the Flash. The person I told you to keep away from. Right. Alright, so here's, here's my strategy. I have crept to the very back end of the map. I'm hiding. At the very, <laughs> very far side of the map. Taking points. Oh, point one. That's me. It is one viable way just to be constantly on the move. Yep, that's, what, think, I'm, the good, that's what I'm trying to do now. Out. I can't beat you in a fight, so I'm just going to try and outrun you and stay on different points. Oh. Now we got some minions coming with me. That's right, guys. Follow Magic Man. We have captured the gas who had a point to spend and didn't realize it. Now, if you go through the middle of the map, you'll see little, like, electrical pads. Those will increase your speed for right. you to travel between areas faster. Yeah, I'm dead. Freaking Flash again. Appeared out of nowhere. He flashed all in there. He came in like a flash. Yeah. Kind of bullshit, I'm not going to lie. <laughs> the enemy has captured the townhouses. Now, there are, like, little blue um, sectors on the map. That or act like the bushes in League of Legends that you can hide in. Okay. So I can hide in the bush, is what you're telling me? Yes. Okay. That, that's good you advice. We're going to get this point here again. Take this point. The enemy has captured Wayne Tower. Wow, that, like, it wasn't even close. This team, like, knew how to play, and we weren't even sure the match had started. <laughs> I mean, clearly our team was... Oh, I didn't want to shoot that yet. Oh, sure how did I not get a kill? How did I not... I didn't get that kill. Son of a... Oh, this game! <laughs> Thought I had a kill, Jay. Ah, uh, We're playing a 4v5 game. We can use that as our excuse. Well, you know, I'm on the team, so it's essentially a, f a 5v3. Oh, jeez. <laughs> so, okay, now you're a big MOBA guy. Let me ask you this, and, and viewers, you can comment, too, if you're big into MOBA. Let me know. Is it just a practice thing? Like, is am I just bad at MOBAs because I don't play a lot of them? Or is there honestly, like, a, you, you gotta be talented and... Oh, what the? Oh, yeah. Who racked up a kill? Yeah. I got a kill. Did you? So did I. Nice. We are epic. <laughs> Justin, my stats are better than yours. Not by much. By one assist. And now they're not anymore because I was gloating. And while I was gloating with the scorecard up, I died. <laughs> so now you're beating me again. So, MOBAs, is it a practice thing? You know, I would get better if I played it, or am I just 
I, I'm never really going to be really good at them because I'm just not, I don't have a knack for it. Well, there, I mean, there is definitely, there's obviously a practice element just like there is to any type of competitive game. The biggest thing you probably want to learn here is learn the characters. Know who you're playing against and know who you're playing as. And item builds. You learn how to you learn how to work your item builds the best for how you play, and you know who you're going up against and who you are, and that completely changes the element of the game because you know what to expect. So right now you have no clue what to expect. Practice and study. Yeah, it's actually a lot of a lot of study. A lot of people just do their studying by play. I am dead again. These last twelve points just won't take away, man. I was I was doing good. I had a I ugh. I was like, come on, match end. I'll take I'll take being tied with Justin's stats on any MOBA game, even if it's one that he hasn't played a ton of. But then they were like, oh no, there's still time left in this match. <laughs> Zero points. Whoa. Was not expecting that explosion noise. I may have just sharked myself. I'm not sure. <laughs> 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 Alright, so that's the survey. Guys, that's Infinite Crisis. Uh, not too much uh, going on. Brand new, but if you like the DC license, it's definitely one to take a look at. Justin, you've played a little more. It's still in beta, obviously, but would you recommend that MOBA fans at least give it a try, or is it just, bah, don't even bother? I say give it a try just for the nostalgia feel of it, and bring along a friend. And just, as long as that friend isn't me, your team's probably already in a better place than ours was when we didn't even know the match had started. <laughs> well, if you guys are watching this on YouTube, make sure to click like, put your comments below, come on over to freetoplay.tv, check out all the other great content we've got there with the reviews, the news, all the other shows, Smat, Derpy Dragon, check it all out, come on over, we'd love to have you there. And until next time, gang, this is Magic Man for J.K. Kennedy saying, stay safe. And we'll see you out on the servers.